I'm uh, 40 years old. I have um, short hair with some silver streaks in it. I have really dark skin <laughs> from a summer of being at the public pools with my kids. Um, I'm about 5'5 five five and fat. Amy Pence Brown is an artist. She was inspired to do this performance art piece by a similar video shared last month. Uh, the woman from Australia was thin and white and young. And so what if you were fat? What if you were maybe about 40 and a mom? <laughs> and maybe you were somewhere different that w like Boise, Idaho. Saturday morning, she stood in the center of the Capital City Farmer's Market, stripped down, blindfolded, and with a chalkboard at her feet, telling passersby to draw a heart on her body if they supported self-acceptance. I was really worried that no one would draw a heart. Within just a few seconds, the first person walked up. Her friend secretly recorded the scene while Amy prepared herself to hear negative comments. Not only did I have a lot of skin to show, but it's thick skin, so that didn't um, really make me um, too nervous. Some people walked in a wide circle around the scene, but Amy says they were still participating in the project. That they stopped, turned around, and stood and watched me and read my sign and watched other people. Um, so they were maybe unwilling participants in the project, but the message hit them. The message hit dozens of people who signed more than hearts. They wrote words of encouragement and spoke to Amy. Um, so I didn't say a lot. I did say thank, uh, thank you. Um, sometimes I did say you're welcome because I got a lot of thank yous back. <laughs> Amy says that's why she did this, to spread self-love. It's something she teaches her three children, a toddler, a second grader, and a sixth grade girl. Um, that all bodies are good bodies is something we say in our house. Amy says there's power in using the word fat. She says she's reclaimed it, and that's just a description of her, not who she is. Um, nearly 40-year-old, um, fat feminist mother, who's a writer and funny and um, kind and cares a lot about her children and her 